little cricket friend. R2 Goodbye. <laughs> I am R2G2. All right, guys, uh, we are gonna go through some of the customization options and things in Biomutant. Um, it's gonna be a whole separate video than our actual, like, you know, first look at Biomutant, but here we go. And for those that wanna watch the actual Let's Play, click here, 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 here. <laughs> they will not be in any of those places because I edit this. Cool. <laughs> but continue, please. <laughs> uh, okay, so we have six different breeds. I, um, I guess? And I'm guessing, oh, yeah. Oh, okay, okay yeah. So, oh my god, the Rex is so cute! They are preset, it looks like, uh, stats. Okay, he's a little fugly. <laughs> okay, uh, he's kind of he's ugly and I cute. I like the Murgle, I think. <laughs> okay, anyway. Oh, there we go. Okay, so I'm guessing the stats are already pre-chosen? Um, maybe I... Kind of looks like it. Why don't you go ahead and read the description? All right. Primal is a nimble, developed, anthropomorphic breed, hybrid with a gene mutation, making them nimble and dexterous at the cost of lesser developed intellect. Okay, ah. so you got speed over your smarts. Got that. Dun Dun. Dum Dun. Uh, least developed anthropomorphic breed, because he looks like a gerbil. A hybrid offshoot that compensates the lack of mental prowess with physical strength. Um, so Not sure he looks like a gerbil to I, me, but continue. He's kind of the same thing. It looks like it's muscle over... Well, this is more like dexterity and agility, I think. This is more muscle. Yeah. Okay, okay, I'm with you. That makes sense. Um, this one. Extraordinary developed anthropomorphic breed of hybrid outcast with an even DF DNA strain, making it apt for both physical and mental challenges. So, so I far. like Rex. Uh, yeah. It's like it takes a, takes a hit to its strength, but it's a little smarter. Uh, Hyla is a regenerative developed anthropomorphic breed, a hybrid with a gene mutation making them extremely tough. So that's the muscle. The big muscle. Big boy. Looks like, yeah, oh, I can sorry. see it. No, you're right. I can, he, he looks the toughest so far. Alright, uh, Fip. 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 Renowned for a highly evolved mind. That's why he's the nerd that no one finds attractive. Um. <laughs> I just... My big gripe about him, I don't like Is his it the eyes. Teeth? Oh, I love the and teeth. The, the mouth and the eye proportion, it just messes with me. Well, he's the brains of the operation. Uh, <laughs> Genius is directed interlinked to the power of key, which amplifies their psychonic output. Ah, there's there's uh, there's spell casting <laughs> in this game. Makes sense. Um, I like well, that. Well, psychics. Okay, go on. And Murgle. the Murgle, the definitive... I Idolized breed, its evolutionary lineage has gone in a direction where form and appearance is dominated over function. So he is charismatic as F. <laughs> <laughs> I can All tell right. he looks like a cat lemur thing, so. So, so far, I really like the Murgle and the Rex and the Primal. I think on my personal playthrough, I'm definitely going to the Murgle. <laughs> yeah, I kind of want to do the Rex, not going to lie. Do the Rex. Let's do the Rex. All right, so we're going to confirm on Rex. Attributes. Define your character's starting attributes to see more detailed explanations of what effect each attribute ha has. Oh. Press this. Define okay. your genetic structure. Oh. Okay, so... Very interesting. Let's look at this. Alright, so, uh, the vitality attribute energy. defines your... What? It, vitality is gonna be your energy. <laughs> okay. Sorry, I was summarizing. <laughs> oh, did you didn't even let me read it yet! <laughs> the vitality attribute defines your amount of health and the energy cost of dodging. Uh, health is obviously health. Armor, okay, strength. Obviously armor, strength, obviously strength. <laughs> it's mostly pretty basic. Go down to key energy. Key energy. Your key energy is used... Or, are you sure it's not Kai? Or key? Kai? It might be Kai. It sounds I'm like really Kai. not sure. We're gonna go with key for now, but it might be Kai. I really can't I tell. I bet it's Kai, because... Sai, kick, Kai. Yeah, I bet it's Kai. You Anyways. wanna go with Kai? Oh, yeah. Alright, so your Kai okay. energy is used for all kinds of combat actions, all special attributes, or attacks. What am I saying attributes for? Attacks, Psi powers, and mutations cost energy to use. Your Kai energy regenerates and can be replenished with consumable items. Nice, okay. Uh, regen. Yeah, obviously, charisma. Agility. Ooh, barter. Yeah, mostly. Loot chance. Yeah, nice. mostly stuff that's in other games. So, okay. um, let's see. What this do we want to do? I definitely so want charismatic. 
and intellect. I love how it's like you can't be strong and smart at the same time. <laughs> I, I, yeah, I, I like the balance on this. I really do. I like how they're trying to balance this. Um, Have you seen any 90s cartoon ever? Brains can't be the bronze. <laughs> Let's see. I, I think I'm going to go with more agility, charisma, and intellect. That's kind of what I figured you were going to do. Oh, but I don't like how weird it gets. Well, like, I said, I I, like I've heard that you can change that later. Oh. Whoa. Um, <laughs> that's creepy. Yeah, uh, it said go for what you want to make, because you can change their their physical appearance later and customization. Okay. I looked that up earlier. Okay, so we're, we're going to do that. definitely charismatic intellect and agility. Go all the way to charismatic real quick. Okay, I was curious what they classified as charismatic <laughs> appearance. You just have an instantly charismatic 88 character. Dang. What if I just go straight in between intellect and charismatic? Yeah. Let's go a little bit more towards charismatic. So we'll do 70 charismatic and 40 <laughs> intellect. You are one attractive brainy. <laughs> I am smart and good looking. <laughs> uh, I surely I can work on like my agility and stuff later. Right? Oh, yeah, I'm sure. I'm sure. I'm sure there it's like a leveling up system it or has something. To be. All right, so we're gonna it's confirm really, this. It's a really unique character creator, though. Yeah, I like it. It's it's definitely different. So confirm yeah, this. Go for it. It's your character. Let's let's confirm Choose it. Choose a genetic resilience. Ooh, Ooh, a genetic resilience. I'm resilient to cold, radioactivity, heat, or biohazard. <laughs> it is bio mutant. Right. <laughs> I'm kind of like I should probably go for radioactivity or biohazard. Because heat and cold, I'm sure there's plenty of things. Um, uh, yeah, I'm sure there's jackets and stuff you can put on. I wouldn't go cold. Yeah, I definitely, I don't think I'm going to go cold. I kind of, I mean, heat would be okay, but I Is think there I'm actually, gonna... like, weather damage in this game? Maybe. Wow. Let's go with, like... I was going to say, I'd lean toward biohazard. Yeah, I think I'm going to go toward biohazard. Actually, I'll go a little bit enough that I can get a little bit on the others, you know? I... Okay. I was gonna say make a 10 and 5, but... Oh, you can kinda... You can kinda go with certain ones. I could go with, like, heat and biohazard and do about, like... Yeah? Like... That? Yeah. Does that look good? That's good. It's probably pretty... We'll go with... We'll go with that. 16% in biohazard and 9% in heat. Okay. There we go. My fur style? <gasps> oh. <laughs> We're gonna be here a while. <laughs> oh. Ooh, I like that one. Huh. What an interesting character creator. Yeah, it's so different. It's so simplistic, but you have to think about it. <laughs> Like, there's definitely a lot to... Like, it's not like, you know, like, Code Vein or something where there's, like, so many things you can do. But, like, there's definitely diversity in, like, so many oh. things you can do with a limited, like, circle. Right. I like this. Oh, that's kind of super cute. I think I really like I, that, I kinda though. Like, I kind of like the rings. Yeah, yeah I kind of really like the, like, rings right there. I think I'm gonna stick with that one. We're gonna go with that. Pick your main color. <gasps> Pick your main color! Oh no! <laughs> <laughs> what is this? What? Oh, I can turn it. Very nice. You can do brightness with R and L, by the way. Uh, you said R and L. Right trigger and left right trigger. trigger. Oh, there we go. This is changing. I think you're too far out. Oh, 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 it's changing. Um. Right? The lines, it looks like. Oh, okay. You see the lines? Yeah. Are they changing color? Um, what do I want my main fur color to be? Jeez. Green. Green. <laughs> I kind of like yellow, honestly. <laughs> I kind of liked the red. Because it's the lines. Yeah, I can see, see it. Like an orange. Ooh, ooh, there we go. Oh, I think, I'm oh, fine. I like that one. Okay, orange. Choose your secondary color. Choose your detail color. My detail color. 
Oh. oh, there we go. That's what I'm talking about. Huh. Ooh. You look like you look like a deformed ratchet from Ratchet and Clank. Let's <laughs> do like a brown. I do like a. Are you trying to make a calico? <laughs> Not exactly. No. Like a Pikachu. <laughs> Actually, more of a Raichu. Yeah, it would totally be a Raichu. <laughs> Absolutely. I kind of like it though. <laughs> I can't even roll around in the mud for too mm -hmm. long. Do I want to go darker brown or lighter brown? I go lighter brown. Do like a, like so a like rebel? That? Yeah, like a rebel brown. You like that one? I like that one. All right, let's go with that one. Pick a class. Okay, here we go. Pick a class. All right. All so right. Mercenary was the deal. Ooh, oh, whoa. God. Mercenary was the DLC class. Oh, right? I forgot about mm -hmm. that. Mercenary uh, is a trained swordsman who has mastered the art of the blade. Okay. That's a good right off the bat. Melee weapon inflicts 10 more damage to its target, so super strong. Twin silver grip. Melee dual wield skill. Equip two different one-handed melee weapons to dual wield them. <laughs> oh my god! I might be playing Mercenary. <laughs> okay, yeah. what's, what's next? Jedi. So you got your rogue, chosen a life outside law and society. Ranged weapons are reloaded instantly, and your next magazine is granted 20% damage. Damn. Okay. Nice. Commando. Yes. Oh my god. Rambo. Uh, commando is trained as an operative of the elite special operations force, used in working with smaller teams. Ranged weapon attacks inflict 10% more damage to the target. Okay. Psychic. Yep. I knew there was going to be a psychic. Uh, are experimenting with psychotic powers and mutations. They're usually outcasts from the French society. Okay, to shoot a spark ball, press down the input. You have bound the ability to throw a ball in the direction you're facing. Uh, key, gen key energy regenerates by 20% faster. Okay. Sabotage. Uh, okay, I <laughs> adore that one. Skillful explorer trained to operate covertly in both suburbs and wilderness. Melee dual wielding. Equip two different one-handed melee weapons to dual wield them. Dodge energy is cost reduced by 20%. So very I don't agile. Know. Very agile, dual wielding swords. Oh no! Do I, I like that one a lot. Do I want mercenary or do I want saboteur? Oh no! I'm kind of leaning toward the saboteur myself. <laughs> Me too! <laughs> and sentinel. Is that a sniper rifle? Uh, it looks like a a stick that you beat people with. <laughs> Your base armor is increased by 10%. So yeah, it's the muscle. It looks like you're just gonna beat someone with a club. <laughs> I love your weasel snarl you got there going on your face. Just, <laughs> <laughs> okay. Um, Man. I'm, I like the mercenary, the dead eye, and the saboteur, personally. Right? So do I. Um. Saboteur is probably what I'm gonna do. That sounds really cool. <laughs> Uh, that or the dead eye. I like the gunslinger idea. Okay, well, but. choose which one you're gonna do, and I'll do one of the others. Okay, guys, we finally figured out what I'm doing. I'm gonna go mercenary because one, it's the DLC class that we got for pre-ordering, and uh, two, we're also gonna play a conjoined thing when they finally get the co-op out, and uh, I'll play saboteur then. But those were my two favorites. I really liked dead eye, mercenary, and saboteur, but I think mercenary and saboteur are my favorite. So let's go with mercenary. Alright. <laughs> I love it. It's so cute. Um I guess we're ready we're to ready go. To start, I guess. Sounds good. <laughs> He's like, yeah, let's go, man. 